Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It has been quite some time since I have sat down and made a video, but today I have a special treat for you. I have a duh, 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 haul video. This will be my Cyber Monday slash birthday haul and I am so excited to show you guys what I got. But first things first, I'm in a different location in my room just because I, I don't know, I just wanted to try this out. The camera is literally just facing a different way, like usually it faces this way, that's where my closet is, but now you get to see my bed. And just to be festive, I put some lights up because I love Christmas lights in my room. And then if you can see, I have some really nice throw pillows from Target. This one has a snowflake on it and this one is gold. And then I have my little baby Christmas tree back there and a really delicious smelling candle. And now I'm officially sweating so that's when you know we better get started with this haul. So let's just start off with the things that I got for Cyber Monday. The first store I'm going to talk about is Target and online they had a buy one get one 60% off. So I chose to get some shoes because I love Target shoes. I don't know about you guys, but I think they are just like the best shoes and they're like so cheap, but they're such good quality. Do you know what I mean? And they're, I mean, like they are comparable to like Forever 21 or Charlotte Russe. Like any place that you normally get your shoes from, Target is right up there with them. Target actually is really prime, I'm not going to lie. They really stepped their game up and I love everything in Target. I live at Target. All this right here and all that, Target, I'm telling you, I love it. So the first pair of shoes I got are these black booty heels and they just have some nice buckles, one, two, three, four buckles up the side and then a zipper in the back and I just thought these were so adorable. This is a really popular style of shoes I feel like right now, especially in like the winter. There are shoes on Topshop actually that remind me of these shoes and I can't afford the ones on Topshop, like they're insane, but I love them so I figured I can get ones that kind of look like it. I mean, if you guys know what I'm talking about, let me know how accurate that is. These kind of look like a Topshop shoe. The next pair of shoes I got are these and these are so unique. Like I honestly love these shoes so much. They are same thing like a black booty heel blah 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 but it's like it's almost like a T strap and it just buckles right up here and this is all open. Again with these shoes I am almost positive there is like an identical pair to this on Topshop. I saw Claudia Saluski talk about these shoes that she loves from Topshop. I mean, not these shoes, but you know, there are shoes like this on Topshop and I was like, oh, I love those too. So I went to the website and I went to go see how much they were and they were just like an ungodly amount of money that I don't have to spend on shoes right now. So when I saw these for 60% off, I was like, yes, yep, I will take those. And I love them. I think they're so cute and they're so like edgy. So I really feel like a badass when I wear these, so I really like these. Okay, so the next store that I shopped at on Cyber Monday was Charlotte Russe. And I don't remember, I think they were having a 40% off, 30 or 40% off the entire site. So I thought that was pretty cool. The first thing that I got from there was these high-waisted leggings and I'm actually returning these because I got a size too big and they're like really really big on me like really really big on me so I have to return these ones but I do like these just because of the fact that leggings tend to cut off like my my hip area because I have like pretty wide hips and it tends to cut off right there and I hate that like I don't want to look like I have a muffin top or anything so I got these high-waisted leggings to you know just hide all that if you know what I mean the next thing I got from Charlotte Russe are these high-waisted jeans and these are by the brand Refuge and I love these you guys like they are amazing and they're very slimming which I 
obviously love and it even says like in the description like skinny high-waisted jeans like makes you slim makes you skinny and these are in the color charcoal so they're I think they're coming off black on camera but they are like a gray color and I just absolutely love these so much I actually have been wearing them ever since I got them in the mail the next thing I got from Charlotte Russe was this romper I just had to get it off the hanger but I got this romper and it is like a blush color and it has these what's that material that has like the sparkles I don't even know it's like that stretchy but like like a dance costume kind of look but I just think it is so adorable and I actually bought this to wear on my birthday which was December 6th and I wore this out to the bar and it has long sleeves and it's shorts and I just thought it was so adorable with like the plunging v-neck and then the color I just thought was really nice so I really like Charlotte Russe for their rompers like their fancier rompers are adorable and I never liked rompers on myself but I just had to make it work because it's so convenient just to throw it all on and then you just have your full outfit and I love this last thing I got from Charlotte Russe was this necklace and I got this necklace to go with that romper and let me just tell you guys that this is the most beautiful necklace I have ever owned. I don't know if you can see like these look like they're just white but actually they're like a iridescent very sparkly like opal type I don't even know. Beautiful beautiful necklace and it actually feels pretty good quality like those of you who have purchased jewelry from Charlotte Russe in the past you know that it's not like the greatest quality in the entire world obviously because it's so cheap but I feel like this is really good quality and it's so stunning I am not kidding I had got a lot of compliments on this when I wore it with that romper and it's just come on really it's beautiful yes okay so now we're gonna move on into makeup and the first store that I shopped at for makeup on Cyber Monday was BH Cosmetics and mind you I was not going to shop like that was not my intention to shop on BH Cosmetics on Cyber Monday and they send me emails all the time and I got an email around 9 o'clock and it said you know hurry up Cyber Monday is going to be ending soon we have um, a huge sale and I'm pretty sure it was 60% off the entire site and you guys know BH Cosmetics is already very very inexpensive and I was like, all right, okay, well, what have I been always wanting from there? And I always hear Carly Bybell talk about the Galaxy Chic palette. And so I was like, why not just get it? You know, it's on sale. And honestly, you guys, this is like a really, really nice palette. Like, all of the colors are stunning. They are so gorgeous. And I doubt the camera is even going to do it justice. But it is a really, really nice palette. They are all shimmery shades and they're pretty good with pigmentation. I mean, it's not like, you know, the be all end all with pigmentation, but I think it's pretty good for BH Cosmetics. Okay, and the last store that I shopped at for Cyber Monday was Ulta, of course. How can I not go to Ulta? So Ulta was having a sale on certain products, but the real reason I wanted to shop at Ulta for Cyber Monday was because they had this thing going on where if you spent over $60, you got a makeup bag full of items. It was um, 19 items, I believe, are in here, and they're all like sample sizes so that you can try them out. And it's actually really, really nice stuff in here. And they have three to choose from. They had the gold, a silver, and then I think a pink one. So I chose the gold. I really liked everything in here. So the first thing I got was the Tea Tree Blemish Fade Night Lotion that you can get from um, the Body Shop. And I just recently bought the entire Tea Tree line and unfortunately I tried it for, because obviously you're going to break out, you know, when you use a product um, for the first time and it's only supposed to last like a week, a week and a half, but when I tried the entire line my face broke out really badly for three weeks straight and it was just in this area which is where I usually break out if it's from a product so I knew it was from that so it was a little bit disappointing I wish it did work for me so I don't know if this is gonna work or not I've heard such good things about it and I would love it if this worked so if you guys have tried this let me know if you broke out from it or if it actually helped you but I have scars on my skin right now and I just wanna I want them to be gone so I wanna know if this will work so let me know about this one 
The next thing I got from Ulta is also a skincare product and it is the Murad Skin Perfecting Lotion. And I've heard incredible things about Murad. I've just never tried them because they're a little bit expensive. But because my skin is such a problem to me and I really, really want to get it under control and I want to perfect it as much as I can, I figured I would spend the extra money and just see what it does for me. So yeah, this one is the Skin Perfecting Lotion, like I said, and this one has Penthanol, I think that's how you say it, Penthanol, and Honey Extract, Retinol, and Queen of Meadow Extract, and then Alatonin and Arnica. The only thing that stands out to me in this entire thing is Retinol, because when I was on my medicine, I don't know if you guys have watched my earlier videos, but I was on doxycycline. They also gave me a retinol cream to go along with that, and the Retin-A is actually so good for my skin. My skin loved the Retin-A, and it didn't, you know, get super dry or anything, and actually really helped. So I figured that this will not only hydrate my skin, but really help out with combating all of the, you know, blemishes, and just help to really smooth down my skin. I just need the bumps to go away. Next thing I purchased was the Benefit Give Me Brow and this one is in light medium and I got this because Shannon here on YouTube, ShanXO, she always talks about it and I mean she has been for a while now, clearly it's been on the market for a while and I've always wanted to try it but I could never justify buying $22 worth of just this. But eyebrows are a big deal to me. I really like a good eyebrow. Who doesn't, right? So I decided to give this a try, see what all the hype was about. And honestly, I've used this probably two or three times so far. Not a lot, but still. I love this product. It is amazing. Like, even if you fill in your eyebrows, like, too much, you can put this over. And it is just, like, I don't know, it's perfect. You know, this has fibers that connect to your actual eyebrow hair and make them look a little bit more full. So even if you don't have any product on your brow, you can put this on and it will look gorgeous. So I definitely recommend this, even though it is kind of pricey, $22, it is worth it. It's a really good product. And last but not least from Ulta, it's kind of a boring one, but I just got the Real Techniques Blush Brush and I have two other Real Techniques brushes that I really really like and I've heard a lot of good things about this one so I just wanted to give it a try for bronzer and I know Lauren Curtis uses this as a foundation brush and so I was going to try you know see which one it would work but yeah nothing special just this brush Standing in the eye of the storm, my eyes start to roam to the curl of your lips in the center of the eclipse in total darkness I Reach out and touch. If you know what song that is, let's be friends. Okay, so the last things I wanted to share with you guys are just a couple gifts that I got for my birthday. So the first things I'll talk about are makeup products that I got because, of course, I would ask for makeup products. I mean, you can never go wrong, right? Makeup is just, ugh. Makeup is life. Let's patent that. Makeup is life. The first things I got are just kind of boring. NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, and I got the colors Prague, Prague, and Amsterdam. I really, really like these so far. I love the matte finish they give, and I really enjoy the colors, so I was really happy that I got these. The next thing I got is also a little bit boring, but something that I have been really falling in love with, and that is the CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous powder foundation and this one is in the color light pale and I really like this powder you guys like I have been stuck on my Rimmel Stay Matte powder which is still a good powder don't get me wrong but I really been liking this this has such great coverage and I find myself not having to put a ton of this on which is awesome because I hate putting too much powder on but I need powder do you see my dilemma so that's why I really like this. Next two things that I got from Ulta are things that I've been wanting for a very, very long time, so I was really happy to finally get my hands on them. And the first thing is the Benefit Hula Bronzer. This has been talked about for as long as I can remember on YouTube. It is a very raved about product, and every time I go into Ulta, I always find myself swatching this and just thinking like, do I really need it, do I? And then finally, obviously my birthday, so I was like, let's take advantage of it right so I got it and I will say I 
love this bronzer. It is pretty light in the box, but it comes off on your skin so nicely. It gives such a great like shadow contour and it just really warms up your skin and I really, really like it. I'm actually wearing it right now and I really like it. Last thing I got from Ulta for my birthday was the Lorac Pro Palette. Oh, this is, oh my gosh, like no words. There are no words for this. Clearly this is also a very raved about product on YouTube and everybody and their mother already has it. I'm like really late jumping on this bandwagon, but I am so glad that I finally did. It is an amazing, amazing, I don't even know if that even is a good enough word to justify how good this product is how good this palette is, rather. The colors are just absolutely gorgeous, and not only are they good colors, really pretty colors, but they are so pigmented and so creamy and so easily blended that it's like, it's literally insane. The entire top row is matte and the entire bottom row is shimmer, and I think that is just genius. This is like all you need. If you're looking to go out and buy a palette, this is the one I would recommend. This one is just so perfect. Everything you need is literally right here, and it's such a compact palette and so sleek. You can just slip it in wherever you go to travel, and it's just, it's going to be all you need. Honestly, you guys, this is so worth the hype awesome. So that is it for my haul, you guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments what you guys got for Cyber Monday. Let me know if you found any good deals and let me know what your favorite thing that you purchased was. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below to come back for more videos from me. And fingers crossed I can get a ton more videos up for you guys. I kind of slack sometimes, but I'm really trying to focus, get motivated, and do this for you guys. If you have any requests for any other videos, let me know down in the comments as well. And I'm pretty sure that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!